if we made it. Do you think the guys will be okay? I'm sure they'll figure something out, probably. But, um, the Badlands are practically a graveyard. Oh, they'll be all right. In the heat? With the skags? I'm not so sure. They probably called for help and had someone pick them up. Yeah, probably. With a caravan like this, we couldn't help them if we wanted to. I hope they'll fix it. We're not exactly rolling in cash right now. How are you gonna get them to do it? I mean, I'm assuming it's not exactly a charity. And we definitely cannot get out of here if we don't get this fixed. Oh, please. This is me doing this. Nothing I can't handle. Okay, don't get too cocky. We'll figure it out, don't worry. Stay here. I'll do the talking. Wouldn't have it any other way. Leaving me out like this. I almost feel sorry for the poor sap. Almost. Scooter must have connections at Dalcorp. Alright, carries the three to five by the twelve. Ah, oh, what the hell, man? I gotta cut down my wrench budget. Oh, oh hey, man! Welcome to Scooter's Catch a Ride! What can we do for you today? Uh... Sorry if I seem a little dis distracted. Uh, hopefully handing this place over to the new proprietor today and I gotta get all these numbers and stuff in order. No, it's a lot. I don't know if you know this, but the transition from small... My ride's... trashed. Think you could help me out? Oh crap, man. That girl's not looking too good. At least I'm assuming it wasn't designed with that whole, uh, you know, hole thing in the inside there. Can you fix it? Hey, man, that's what the sign says I do, don't it? No, seriously, does it? I can't, I can't remember what I put on the new billboard. Point is, I can fix her up for you, yeah? <laughs> Holy crap! I knew I recognized this rig from somewhere. You were in the latest Boston Over Death Rally. Oh, I was there, man! Did you see me? I was, I was waving. You were a badass. Oh, <laughs> yep, got me. That thing's beat up to hell and back, man. I could fix it, but it's probably gonna run you about twenty-five hundred cold. Twenty-five hundred? Uh, that's a little out of my price range. Not to be implied or nothing, but you must have won a buttload of money from that race, right? Where did it all go? Oh, cause my cousin, right? He said that his sister's friend's neighbor's husband won one of them races one time and the cats kept them fed for weeks. Yeah, someone stole it. Can you believe that? Yes, actually. Yes, I can. Well, tell me this. You think you could ever see yourself racing again? Let me pitch you something, and it might be crazy. But if you keep racing, I would love to endorse you as a sponsor. What do you say? It'll be great, maybe like a billboard, a couple of commercials, product placement. Scooter, sir, you have yourself a deal. Yeah? Oh man, this is awesome! You will not regret this, no way, no how, man! But, uh, say it once for me, man, you know? The catchphrase? Catch a ride! You know it, come on. Don't be shy, I'm your sponsor now. Gotta hear how you do the catchphrase. Catch a ride! <laughs> I'm thinking that we put a big old ad on your van, you know, like maybe a picture of me with like, catch a ride up above it, you know, all cool, right? I'm looking all badass, you need to put some badass pictures of you with your car and your hat and all that. Hi, 
Scooter, right? Everything going okay? <laughs> I was, uh, I was just gonna, you know, go grab the paperwork, let me take care of that. Okay, bye. All right, man, here's my standard endorsement contract. Don't mind the sub clauses about explosions and whatnot. I might have copied it from Torg. Anyway, I figure as long as I'm in there and you're yeah, doing it for free, maybe you want to splurge and get some of the special packages. I got some good ones. I know it's a big decision. You go ahead and take your time. A lot of good choices, I know, I know. Real classy ones, too. Sometimes I just stand here. That is some fine taste, man. Like a treat for yourself and for me getting to do it. Can't wait. Come on in, man. We'll get her all hooked up and get to work. Oh, crap. This doesn't look good. Hey, fellas, what can I do you for? Oh, no. I just hope that little deal you two struck is enough to get him to look the other way. Scooter won't turn us in. You don't know that. We don't even know what the reward is this time. You just gotta have some faith, Sasha. Out of teach him. Hope you ladies weren't too scared. Just doing my duty to keep ruffians the crap out of my garage. I'm a real protector type. Thanks. Hi, man, it was no big deal. Proper man ain't got to turn in two nice-seeming ladies. You might be murderers or some crap, but you ain't tried to murder me yet. <laughs> but seriously, please don't try to murder me. Seems like there's some bad men looking for you two, though. You got a place to lay low while I'm getting your ride all fixed up? I don't think Felix is as too far away. If we're careful, we can make it on foot. Then, let's do it. We shouldn't hang around here too long. Looks like he had company while he was away. It could have been Felix. Could be. Come on, look around. We gotta be in and out. Yeah. I got the door. He always complained about the reception on this thing. Right. A phonograph is more to his taste. If it's all the same to you, I could do without Felix's classical music right now. It's empty. It's strange. The can's wet, but I don't see any paint. Hmm. Weird. It's empty. It's strange. The can's wet, but I don't see any paint. Hmm. Weird. Hmm, here we go. Always nice to see an old friend. 
Doesn't look like he changed anything. Probably means there's nothing in there. Great, a flashlight. Maybe if we go camping. It's a black light. It's the one Felix used to check our first counterfeit bills. Oh, it looked familiar. It's hard to believe that asshole would be sentimental enough to keep this in his safe. Not unless he meant for us to find it. What's that? A grenade? Yeah, looks like another one of Felix's homemade projects. Well, let's take it. Felix sure was into science fiction. I had to force this on him once his eyesight was starting to go. Yeah, stubborn as always. I couldn't even get him to stop using floppy disks. Felix's favorite chair. Those few times he felt he could relax anyways. A comfort directly proportional to its wear. You were always a better shot than me. Man, it used to drive me crazy. That was a long time ago. Who is she? I don't know. They look happy, though. It's empty. That's strange. The can's wet, but I don't see any paint. Hmm. Weird. Sasha, look at this. What the hell? It's ultraviolet paint. I guess he wanted to keep all this a secret. Well, he left this for us to find, so... There's something he wanted us to see. Ah! I see it! Right there! Awesome! If you find another flashlight under there, I'm leaving. Guess that's what we're searching for, huh? Guess so. Here we go. Better double check the contents. Oh, hello, sexy. You're coming with me. What is it? A 
It's an echo comm. Why is there... If you're seeing this, I suppose I'm either dead or worse. My plan worked. I'm sorry. Fiona, Sasha, there's so much I want to tell you, but the less you know, the better. Oh, give me a break. Halfway through the con, I realized we were messing with Valerie's people. I knew that, and I never revealed it to you two. Well, if you're watching this, it won't be long before she's coming after you. Change your names. Change your appearance. Change your life. I believe him. I believe Take he was protecting us. And go. Forget about the life you had. And forget about me. But know that I love you both. With all my heart. <sighs> I'm sorry. What are you sorry for? You're not the one that left. The one that lied. I'm not gonna listen to another second of his bullshit. I can't believe you let him live. Why did you warn that son of a bitch? Should have let that case explode right in his face. I couldn't let that happen to him. It was always about the money. The second a big score showed up, he betrayed us. We had it. We had it in our hands, Fiona. Ten million dollars. Enough to get off this planet. Enough to... to buy a new life. First, we find this vault. Take all the riches it contains, then we'll get off this rock. I promise you, one of these days you'll be looking down on Pandora from space. I'm gonna hold you to that. You always do. You want a sandwich? It might be a while before we eat again. Sure. Huh. Wonder what's in this. What is it? It's some sort of an upgrade. Still only holds a single shot, but it looks like it adds an elemental effect to the bullet. It looks like a backup plan. Good thing this comes with another shot. I spent the last one I had trying to kill your boyfriend. You better shut up. He left you something, too. I don't want it. Are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm sure. You're not even a little curious? No. I'll just hold on to it for you. In case you change your mind. I won't. So stubborn. You really gonna turn down the man's going away gift to you? Cold blooded. For right? You should be ashamed of yourself. Hands up, both of you. What you making? Sandwich. Hmm. Huh. Why you got a pan going for a sandwich? I like an egg on it. Who are you? He's Finch. I'm Croak. Heard me going up. You see me looking at you. 
Make him shoot through that nice floor. And for what? For nothing. You two got every bounty hunter in Pandora looking for you. And you're making a sandwich? Tie her up. Let's get out of here. Ooh! She's fast. Please. You embarrassing yourself. Go on. Fiona, shoot him! Do it. You're pointing that at a dude who has people shoot him in the chest for fun. I'm usually drunk and charge 40 bucks, but you can have this one for free. Go on. I won't even clinch. Fiona, no! <laughs> me going up. You see me looking at you. Make him shoot through that nice floor. And for what? For nothing. You two got every bounty hunter in Pandora looking for you. And you're making a sandwich? Tie her up. Let's get out of here. Ooh! She's fast. Please. You embarrassing yourself. Go on. Fiona, shoot him! Do it. You're pointing that at a dude. You all right, man? Oh, yeah. Re real good. <laughs> Look, you don't have to be a tough guy about it. It's cool. Hey, man. Hey! They come in.